Real Property Management at EnterprisesRPM.com presents 2900 Brownstone Road. This property is a massive five bed, three and a half bath with a two car garage, single family home. And it's located just off of North May and Kilpatrick Turnpike or Memorial Road. For a detailed map listing, you can view it at our website at EnterprisesRPM.com. As you can see, as we're walking up this sidewalk, there are many beautiful trees scattered throughout the front yard, as well as over to our right here in the flower beds. The entryway is a completely covered porch with a... As we enter through this double door entryway, we'll get a scan of the layout over here. Directly to our right is the office space and going down this first set of stairs here You'll see our living room backyard access and over to the right past there You'll see our kitchen half bath laundry and garage access Going up these stairs here and if we were to go to the right is our hallway with our other bathrooms and our spare bedrooms Over to the left is our master suite Going back down we'll have our full master bathroom and bedroom. All right, let's get this tour started. We'll start directly where I said, in our office. Office has amazing built-in shelves, as well as this gorgeous view of the street, as well as all of those trees I was talking about earlier. Going back through those double door glasses. Continuing on down the stairs. You can see the hardwood floors layered throughout this living room. And a nice panoramic view here. You can see those bright windows laying in all the light into the room. We have our separate dining area here. And over in the corner is our half bath. The kitchen is quite open and expansive here. The long island throughout the center. And a separate area here for the breakfast bar. Over to our right here is where you'll find the laundry and the garage access. Here we can get one more shot and see what the kitchen looks like from this angle, as well as the living and the dining area. Alright, moving on through, we're going to cut out to the backyard. You can get a beautiful view of this amazing in-ground pool. Now, on each side, we have a full wooden privacy fence, which follows along until you hit the back here, where you've got a gorgeous view of this creek in the back that is luckily not fenced off, so you can always take a look at it. Here, you'll see the view of the house. You can see the balcony from up here. We'll go up there in just a minute. All right, we're going to head back into the house now. So we get one more view of this pool. Moving back on through. Go back exactly the way we came, back up those stairs. We'll get to the master bedroom last, but first we're going to go up the main set of stairs here. And you can see the secondary living area over here. We have those three large windows, just like the bottom living area, let in all that light. And here, we have an angled ceiling, so you know it goes all the way up. Now we're going to go down this main hallway, and this will lead us to our three smaller bedrooms here. Starting first, over on the left, we have our main small bedroom right here. Just like the others, it has a wall, a full walk-in closet. And then this one is unique, as it's got the only, is the only bedroom here with a balcony access. Don't fret too much though if you don't get this bedroom, as the living room over to the side that we just saw also has backyard or balcony access. 
Moving back on through. We still got two more bedrooms and one bath to show on this area. We'll start with the bathroom. Dual sink and one single long vanity stretching across the entirety of it. With a separate area for the tub and the washroom. Tub is single with tile throughout with a shower built in. Going back on through, if we're going back out into the hallway, over on our left, second bedroom. And then, of course, just like the other ones, has a full walk-in closet. Going back out into the hall, we've got a short flight of stairs to go up. And then we have our third bedroom. This one is definitely the most unique of this house. As I'll get over to this corner so you can see quite the layout it has. You can see going down there, we have two double door closets as well as the attic space access. And then and up another flight of stairs, we have the attic loft. And as we're going up those stairs, I'll do a quick turnaround so you can see that it has a set of doors. It's not quite a balcony, but it has a rail so you can open those out. And it's just like simulating the real thing. Going back up here, I mean forward up here, we have our last small bedroom or attic loft, whatever you'd like to use it for. There's a space over in the corner. And right now it's being used as another bedroom. All right, that's it for this hall. So we're gonna quickly shuffle back down the stairs and back down that hallway. And then we get to take a look at the master suite. Now the master suite here is of course different from all of the others as it has the largest closet space in this home. You go all the way up these stairs past the double doors in this closet and you could fit quite a bit of your stuff in here. We'll get a view as we're going to go up those stairs over to the side here so you can get a bit of a higher view of what this closet looks like. All right. Now that we're done gushing over this closet, we have a bathroom that's directly connected to this suite to show. Going into the bathroom, this one, just like the other one, has dual sinks, but it has two separate vanities. A separate single tub is over on the west side of the house. And then turning directly around, it has a massive looking shower at its door over on the other side. The thing about this shower is that it has several separate water spouts for the water to come out of. As you can see. Alright, we have just one more room to show and that's the single master bedroom. Going out back into the hallway, back down those stairs at the front entry. Uh, tucked away over in this corner is our master bedroom. Now this one I love as it has a fireplace right in the center of it. It's very expansive. It's almost as if you could fit quite a bit of stuff in here. It will most definitely fit a king size bed. Turning around and going back through. Now we go down these stairs and we have two separate single closets over here. One is over to our left and of course these are walk-ins and the other is over to the right. Both similarly designed. Same sliding door setup on each one and that leads into the master bath. And this master bath is just slightly different from the others. 
Same tub over in the corner. We have a dual sink and dual vanity over on this side. Turn it back around. Over in this corner, we have a shower that's not unlike the other one, just a bit wider. But what's unique is this door, which leads into a private sauna. Which, I think this is personally my favorite addition to this entire home. And just left that, it's a water closet. And that will end our tour of this beautiful home. If you're interested in applying for it, you can view it at our website, enterprisesrpm.com. As always, this has been Real Property Management Enterprises. Thank you so much for watching.